Sopo ini eh dia tinggal dia pada ada Hey guys, how are you? Happy New <laughs> I don't know why I was saying that. Oh my god, I'm so excited right now. I just finished blow drying my hair and I recorded it, but I don't think it's going to be part of the vlog. I think it's just going to be on its own as a video on its own. So I don't know, Sha. And I was like, ah, what am I saying? <laughs> I forgot what I'm saying. So uh, I will show you guys, Cha, how the hair looked like when I finished with it. It was really nice. My hair was really big. I was like, wow, <gasps> I'm so happy. But I didn't feel like straightening it. So I just did this while I was in class. I just bound to knot it. So I'll keep it in this for for the weekend or so. And I think I still need to moisturize my hair because I didn't have a lot of leave-in conditioner when I was doing the whole thing. Anyway, I'm super excited because there are some books I wanted to get and Crash just told me that someone wants to sell her books. This girl is Jack Pine. The girl is Jack Pine, so the girl wants to sell her books. And those books are is a series, twisted series, and I'm so happy. So I just thought immediately I want it. The person she said is please pick up, pick up, pick up. I don't care if it is new or not. As far as the book is book, and the book is still neat. So of course, yes, I am I'm gonna I'm gonna buy it. So yeah. That's what's shocking me right now. Oh, she just sent me another picture. Let me show you the mess I made. Like, look at look at the mess. So, oh, another gist, guys. I I went to go and buy gloves, latest gloves, because I wanted to wash my hair. And I have to say that it's actually the best decision I've ever made because oh more, more it helped me with my hair. So I need to clean the place. Like, can you see how messy everywhere? Look at my hair on the floor. Uh, look at my table. So oh, everybody is just a mess. So I have to clean everything. Stylist, see, you know that saying that they used to say, hair stylists have horrible hair because they don't think no, 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 What is this? Please. Beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful. So she's selling jewelries too, and I was thinking about picking this one. It looks nice, but this dangling thing is my problem. So we have this steel also. But I wish I got silver instead of the gold I got because it was already, it's already fading. Pierces. You pierce your nipples. <laughs> I didn't say that. <laughs> I didn't say that. You said it with I all. I did not. I don't like lies. You like... <laughs> <laughs> delete the numbers. That don't wow him, Bill. Eh? Hey, money go delete the number. <laughs> eh? Hey. Money. Anything more? more. Eh? Number eight, eight, eight. Ah, I will buy me in money to pay. Daddy, wa? Am I being no sir? Me money to pay. Sir. Yeah, you wait. I need me more. Yeah, never do it. 
I'm a very good one. I'm a very Small boy, ni and daddy not like my dad. Abi, Benny, I say, I say, mom, mommy, you me. Moti be meta. So, I say, I say, ma, we le for the gun, cause we be on lo. Yeah, the job is in queue. Moti, I'm bored. Daddy, I wo. I'm a boy. I wo. Delete number. Oh, dad, but ma, you can't call me le, me le. Magicals. If the person actually knew me, mm. he would have known I'm not the one speaking. No. <laughs> you cannot speak your own like that. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> People like that, you don't don't stress them. Help them to bond their cut very well. What is that? The conversation is not getting anywhere. They will drop the call. And they will not bother calling. Are you calling again? No. I'm alone. I'm only GBT. Do you remember for instance that number? I keep losing. I don't call anyone with it. It's my head tell. Too much shara. So now she's got to pay. Don't you phone it. I've been sleeping in and skipping showers. Daylight's creeping in, but I can't open up my eyes. So sick of heartbreaks, mistakes, losing my cool. These lazy Sundays, always thinking it through. Now I'm pissed. Share this, my my baby. Yeah, I want to be laying. It's not so much like this. It's not much. Ah, no, so you're the one that you sent. No, those ones are not normal. This one for stars. I love it. I did find it around the video. But in a very yes, I always on my phone, but got no time to say hello. I wish I didn't have to fake a smile. I know you seem so happy. I'm so sick of all the breaks, mistakes, losing my cheek. This is a sunrise, always thinking. Hey, girl, I should have to do my makeup. I have to say, I tried to redo the edges. I cannot do it the way she did, and I feel like the hair she left in the front was too much. Cause me, I'm not into all those paparazzi of swoop, swoop the whoop of the whoop of the swoop. So I just did anything, and it's still the same day. So we're going out now. I want to go buy some things at the mall, um, and I want to try to do a little bit of meal prepping because. I want to go back into the dieting stuff so this week is going to be like a trial week so i'm not really going to show you guys me meal prepping i'll take you guys with me to the market of course i'll just show you i'll record my phone not with my camera because I, I i don't think i'll carry my camera well so i'll record my phone and when i come back home i'll probably just show you after i'm done meal prepping because i feel like i'm not really i don't know how to do it yet well by the time i master it then i'll now show you how i meal prep or stuff like that maybe i'm ready i'll go to the market my hair is nice. I think I prefer it uh, when it's uh, what what it calls when it's wrapped up. It looks way way better. Like it's way better than when it's not wrapped up. Yeah, it's giving classy. Got me. Nothing special. Just my so that I can easily do whatever I want to do. Same old things every time 
When I stop communicating, you hit in my line. Asking about my whereabouts and if you still are mine. But I don't want to hear your questions. You just waste my time. Like, where you at? How you been? Are you solo or with him? Can we just chill for a minute? Yeah, we don't need to do nothing. But when you around. I'm so tired. And I don't want to be on my feet. I am very, very exhausted. Ah, you guys. <laughs> Immediately we came back, babe came to sleep and he hasn't sleeping since like since when we came back you guys i'm so freaking tired so i'm supposed to make a video public on my reaction channel i've not edited the thumbnail so i want to do that i have to edit the thumbnail right now and also the vlog for tomorrow i've not even finished it i've not even edited it so i have to finish editing it this night so i can upload it this night so that it can go public tomorrow so i did the meal prep kind of stuff and it's in the fridge but i was not really impressed with the way i cooked the f4 i don't know whether i don't know how to cook f4 now or what because baby's not going to eat it because it's too pepperish like it's very pepperish i didn't even anticipate that one but i like pepper babe also likes pepper but not as much as i do anyway sure I, I think i already showed you guys these three books that i got at med plus this one this one and this one i literally was shocked about this this particular one because i'm like i didn't know that it was a small book like this but it has 300 and what am i saying is it even 300 yeah 320 pages i just like curled the hair like see i don't know if you guys can see the tiny curls my hair is forming i used my coconut um curling cream the canto so it gave me all these tiny ringlets of curls and my I tell you guys about the books i just i finished it like this is going to be the i think 
the second book i'll be finishing in a day honestly like i was so i was so into the story and the book is actually not that much and the writings are not that uh together so it was easy for me to finish it honestly you guys this is my first time reading a mystery book and i really really loved it you guys should go and read this book just go and read it i decided to come and talk to you because tomorrow i'm sure i want to record videos reaction videos so i may not really have time to tell you guys so let me just tell you guys about it's about three girls janet iberi and Pamem, pa, b, b, pamela <laughs> okay so janet iberi and pamela janet was killed but the person made it look like it was an accidental kind of death like she drowned iberi is a jehovah witness girl <laughs> So you know our parents are now on Christmas day they go and they go and preach the gospel, you know now. And the third girl, Pamela, that one lives with her dad. So Pamela started receiving notes. These notes like written in blood. Like notes saying that uh I'm, you are next, stuff like that, something like that. So apparently, you know, Pamela was scared and first she was so she was <laughs> She was suspecting her friend Iberi. That Iberi, I really loved her character. I just felt like she was too serious. She was too, uh, like, they even started like, sending her for therapy. Like, she should go for therapy to a doctor and stuff like that because of the death of Janet. But that's the cocoa of the story. Finding who the murderer is, and they almost died. And the person that was the murderer will shock your balls. If you have balls, it should shock your balls, you guys. This book is so good. Like I was even opening to the back to check if I will understand the story because I just wanted to know who the killer was. But I, when I go to the back, I don't understand any nonsense. So I had to go back to where I was in the beginning. Then it's a shy fun read. You guys go read it. What happened to Janet? Who's all? Yes, yes. I gave it five stars on Goodreads. I was saying I don't understand how people give their stars on Goodreads. But I feel like if a book makes you happy and you enjoyed the read and it was cool like why why well some people are literally inclined so they look for loopholes and stuff like me i don't really care about that i just care about if a book is nice if it's i enjoy the story and if i could relate with it and i could relate with it so many pigeon english in this book <laughs> then I, I didn't think i told you guys about this one this book actually when i started reading it i don't know that because the book is about a cook but i was feeling hungry I was just, but I love a lot of things about this book. This book is not a romance book. It's also a YA book. This girl, Emony, she's a single mom. She gave birth to her daughter at age 14. Guys, 14. And now she's 17. And the book just literally talks about how she's trying to juggle school, working, taking care of her grandma and a child and everything, you know. And she loves to cook. The way they talk about cooking, like the way the food makes people feel in this book is really really good like you eat that food and you start to have memories remember things that you love like this book was really really good another cool thing i loved about it is the recipes like there are some recipes in the book that are really really cool like let me show you guys the sour this is a recipe for something and it's actually really, i'm not trying any of the recipe because obviously i cannot try it but yeah hey guys i really love these two books yeah now I can go and sleep in peace. I was waiting for rain to stop for so that I can tell you guys. I can just tell you guys about the book. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Do you guys enjoy when I talk about books? Just let me know in the comment section because I don't know if you guys really enjoy it. Or maybe I'll just put time put time stop for you guys to so you can skip the book talk. Discussion worth it a while. You cut them ties by the 